Welcome back to the 3D Bot Maker Diecast Racing League. It's time for the Fast and Famous Car Tournament Finals. We've got James Bond, Michael Knight, Doc Brown, and B.A. Baracus. They are getting ready to take the track, but first up, we have a special presentation brought to you by Mr. Bean. That's right, it's the Flying Bean, Bean Stunt Show. Show. Mr. Bean will be attempting to jump over not one, but two Pontiac Fieros. Crazy Jimmy was kind enough to loan us both his Ferrari Championship Fiero and his Rally Fiero. Mr. Bean will be performing this stunt from the top of his car. Hopefully he drives better like that than how he raced in the tournament. Yeah, I don't see how he's going to do any better like that, but he volunteered to do it, and he signed not one, but two waivers. Nice. So. Sounds like we got our bases covered. Yes, we do. Here we go. It's Mr. Bean on top of his Austin Mini Cooper driving down Race Mountain to jump over two Fieros. What could go wrong? And there he goes, hand in the air, waving to his fans as he approaches his impending doom. He's such a showman. Surprisingly, he makes it around the corner. Here he comes. The Flying Bee. Hey, and Mr. B. Hello? Testing. Uh, Steve, I think the cable came out. No, I can't hear myself. Check the cable. Testing. Hello? Test, test, test. Test, test. Oh, there we go. And we're back. Mr. Bean lands the jump with his car, but he himself got ejected from the roof and ended up over here at the announcing table. That was pretty crazy, huh, 2D? 2D, you good, bro? Can someone get him a paramedic? Who, me? Yeah, like now? Uh, sorry about that. Uh, we're experiencing some uh, technical difficulties. Here's another look at that spectacular jump. Did we have 2D sign waiver? I don't know. I know he works here. That should be an automatic, but I just want to make sure. Ask Susan. Yeah, yeah, ask Susan. Uh, this just in, we have good news. Mr. Bean is okay. His arm is just stuck up in the air. We still are having some technical difficulties here over at the announcer booth. Uh, 2D's on the ground. I believe he's just checking out some loose wires down there. He's got some assistance helping him, so... Uh, Can we cut yet? Break? Yes? Okay. Uh, we're gonna go to commercial break. This holiday season, give her something really special. Something that says, I know you better than anyone else. A timeless gift, a classic, that she'll remember and cherish for holiday seasons to come. Like the Crazy Brothers racing shirt, that will remind her if you ain't first, you're last. Or the DRC champion Stephen King shirt, because rally ain't easy. And who could forget the McClyde Van Angel shirt, race in peace McClyde. While you're at it, get one for the entire family. Trust me, she'll be glad you did. The Three Botmaker Diecast Racing League is not responsible for any bodily harm that may occur from buying your significant other merch for the holidays. And welcome back to the Fast and Famous Car Tournament Finals. Uh, 2D, nice to have you back with us. Oh man, that was crazy. My life flashed before my eyes, and I gotta say, man, I've had a pretty freaking awesome life. Oh, well, that's good. Sports cars, beautiful women. I had a British accent at one point. You know, I think you're confusing your life with James Bond. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Anyways, the next thing I remember was waking up with a taste of motor oil in my mouth and some dude telling me to walk it off. Yeah, that sounds about right. But hey, glad you're back in time for the Fast and Famous Car Tournament Finals. We've got James Bond in the Aston Martin DB5, Michael Knight driving in Kit, Dr. Emmett Brown in the DeLorean Time Machine, and B.A. Baracus in the A-Team van. James Bond will be starting off on the front right and Dr. Emmett Brown on the front left. Let's see if Doc Brown can get that DeLorean up to 88 miles per hour. If he does, you're gonna see some serious shit. <clears throat> and here we go with the start of four races. James Bond currently out in lead as he goes through the first corner. Doc Brown in second, Doc Brown gaining. Doc Brown takes the lead. Bond tries to take it back, we got some contact there. Oh, and that was inevitable. Down goes B.A. Baracus. Looks like he took Michael Knight out with him. Doc Brown still with the lead here, he's going back and forth. He's stuck on the side. And here comes 007 to steal the win over Doc Brown. Oh man, the Doc had that one in the bag. I don't know if he had a malfunction with the flux capacitor, but he totally blew that race. Great Scott, you can't do that in the finals. If only he could go back in time, I'm sure he would do that differently. Yeah, but you gotta watch out for the butterflies. It's a familiar sight over on turn two with B.A. Baracus over on his side. I can already hear the angry fans. Yeah, I'm with him. He's totally ruined the race for some of these drivers. We could just kick him out of the race. Uh, do you want to be the one to tell him that? Nope. Okay then. 
Doc Brown here blowing a significant lead over James Bond. He probably would have done better having the dog drive the car. I think he was still driving the car remotely while Einstein was in it. Maybe he's doing that right now. Hmm. Well, it's not against the rules, so... Here we go at the start of race two. We've got Doc Brown on the front right and B.A. Baracus on the front left. I'm just hoping B.A. doesn't block everybody on this race. We'll see if he learned his lesson from the first round. Doc Brown currently on the lead. B.A. Baracus gaining on the outside. It's a tight race between Brown and B.A. They're side by side. Here they go into turn two. B.A. makes it out alive. He's in the lead. Go A team, go. Can he make it around the final corner? And he does it. Doc Brown and Bond not far behind. And B.A. Baracus will take the checkered flag. That was a close race for a second between James Bond and Doc Brown. I am not sure who got it. Man, I'm surprised B.A. won a race. Me too. I pity the fool. Here's a look at the replay. Doc Brown and B.A. side by side. Now look at this. Doc Brown actually keeps B.A. low on that turn, giving him the assist he needed to stay on all four tires. Here he is navigating around the final corner. You'll see right here. He starts to go high again, but somehow manages to gain traction and it was all downhill from there. That was a great race. Look at Doc Brown and James Bond, neck and neck at the finish line. That was a photo finish. We're gonna go to the sky cam. Here they come to the finish, and it's Doc Brown by a bumper. That's gonna give Doc Brown three points on the board. He's currently in third place. B.A. Brockus in second with five, and James Bond on top with seven points. B.A. starting off on the front right and Michael Knight on the front left. The Knight Rider trailing points, he only has one. Here we go, A-Team versus Knight Rider. It's a close one. B.A. Brockus pulls ahead as he goes to the open section of track. Michael Knight on his tail. Knight hits B.A. from behind. B.A. Oh. Brockus is over. What's this? Here comes Michael Knight. Whoa. Somehow he escapes the chaos. He's grabbing the final corner. And it looks like this race will go to Michael Knight driving in kit. I don't know how he did it, but that right there put him back in the game. Michael Knight goes from fourth place in points to second. He is only one point behind James Bond. And he has B.A. Baracus to thank for that. A very predictable wreck by B.A. Baracus on turn two. And when you look at that, James Bond with the assist, giving Michael Knight the bump he needed to make it down the hill. Luck certainly appears to be on Michael Knight's side. With one race left, he just might take this one. He is starting off on the front right. James Bond to his left. They are both the top two in points. James Bond with seven, Michael Knight with six. With B.A. in the back row, nothing should get in their way. Here we go with the fourth and final race. Michael Knight with the early lead. James Bond on his side. It's a close race coming out of turn one. James Bond looking to pass. We've got contact. Michael Knight swung down Bond. He got him with a block. Knight ahead of the pack by about five car lengths now. He's going through the final corner. Bond and Doc Brown not far behind. Oh, he gets stuck. Oh, no. And James Bond follows suit. Doc Brown gets stuck behind the Aston Martin. And I don't see B.A., but I'm guessing... He must have wrecked up on turn two. Uh, yep, that's exactly where he is. Oh man, what a crazy race. Michael Knight pretty much did the exact same thing that Doc Brown did in the first race. He was all by himself around the last corner, comes out of it, loses control, pops up on the side of the track. And there goes James Bond doing the exact same thing. I thought he was gonna knock him back on the track right there, but in this race, luck was not on his side. I'll tell you who was on his side. B.A. Brockus in the A-Team van. Man, how did that van even qualify for this race? Intimidation. Ah, uh, that makes sense. You try telling B.A. he doesn't qualify. Yeah, no, I get where you're coming He's from. He's a big dude. And here we go. The drivers are back at the start for the restart of the fourth and final race. Michael Knight once again on the front right and James Bond on the front left. Bond pulling ahead as he goes in the first corner. Last time Knight had the block. Bond trying to avoid that. And he does. He's got a big lead now. Followed by Doc Brown. Michael Knight and B.A. wreck back on turn two. Bond's got a big lead. Hopefully he doesn't blow it. He's cleaning out of the corner. Here we go. And James Bond <laughs> is your fast and famous car tournament champion. 007, baby. Great racing there by James Bond. A six-point win over the competition. And there's Doc Brown. He needs to forget about going back to the future and go back to the garage. Michael Knight stuck on turn two. B.A. Baracus. No surprise there on his side once again. Looks like Michael Knight tried that block maneuver on B.A. I said it before. I pity the fool who gets in front of B.A. Baracus. Once again, great driving there by James Bond. I'm not quite sure what happened to Doc Brown. Maybe he was running low on plutonium. I'm telling you, I think the dog's in the car. And here he is, your fast and famous car tournament champion, James Bond, driving in the Aston Martin DB5. Once again, another James wins the tournament. Wow, I didn't realize that, but yes, this has been the year of the James. James Bond will be joining Crazy Jimmy, Crazy James, and Mad for Robots. Susan in the 2020 championship race. That's going to be awesome. We also have one more surprise tournament before the end of the year. Oh, you mean the... Yep. 
That's going to be good. We'd like to thank everyone for joining us in this tournament. You've been watching the 3D Bot Maker Diecast Racing League, the home of Diecast Sports Action Racing. <laughs>